I think we're ready. I think we are too. Hello everyone. We've got so many people in the house already. Hi. Hi. It's Kylie Batucci. My name's Bruno. Stampin' Up Demonstrators in Australia. Whoop whoop. <laughs> How are you this morning we're, everybody? We're Aussies and we say g'day. 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 So has, so has everybody got their beverage? No? I didn't have my beverage, no, Bruno, because Kylie decided to cook bread this morning. Yes, and literally, <laughs> just as we're about to go live, should I, should I bring it in? The oven. Bring it, in. it was all planned, wasn't it? <laughs> no. It's so literally, not just as we were about to go live, the oven starts beeping because it's time to get the bread out of the oven. Um, so we're very excited. I can't really smell it because I still can't smell. But here it is. Here it's we go. Bocaccia. Oh! <laughs> and it's fresh and it's hot. So Bruno will have to tell you the story. I have been trying to cook bread for two years. Literally since the start of pen. And I'm like, it. why is my bread it's really not hot working? Against my face. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> why is my bread not working? And uh, Bruno was a genius. I said, have you checked the yeast? The Is yeast it, by... The yeast by date on the yeast was used by January 2020. 2020. And she had like boxes of the sachets <laughs> of yeast. And they were all out of date. And the first one she made probably about a week ago. Well, the, in this round. Because there's been rounds of bread making. Well, what I'd do is I'd try it. Then it wouldn't work. And I'd be so defeated. I'd be like... I'm, I'm never making I'm bread never again. making bread. Like, literally like that. I'm never making bread. <laughs> it was devastating. Yeah. I thought I couldn't bake. And then... But then, yeah. Now literally, I'm like, how, that, how when many she loaves? Dis when she discovered it, I went to the shops. I bought two different types of yeast. I bought it in a, um, like a jar style, and as well as the yeast, the sachets. <laughs> two different types. And she's been baking ever since. Yeah. Even your mum and dad were impressed, weren't they? They were like, how do you make that bread? Yeah. <laughs> it is amazing. Like, it's <gasps> really good. Anyway, I'll go put it back now because it's heating but up your this face. But this isn't a bread making channel. <laughs> You're here for craft. But I will say that if anybody has a Thermomix, um, which Kylie does, um, she'll post the recipe somewhere. Okay. Yeah, I'll share, I'll share the cook-eyed recipe. It's from cookie Doo or cook eyed yeah. um, and she will share that. Yeah, I'll share the recipe, because it's really good. It's so easy. Now, before we go on, Kylie, I just want to draw your attention to that yes. um, message. Is that okay? It does that sometimes. Okay. Now, what's happening in the comments? Hello, There's all. a lot of people here. Wow, how many people are watching? Jesse Scott can smell it. Very nice. She's my she's my thermo gal, my Jessie gal. She looks after me. If anyone wants to buy a thermo mix, <laughs> she, she, she and I love to say that. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know. Not we don't us. know anything. <laughs> um, so we have a couple of things to go through with you today. We have celebration, which yes. is on at the moment. Uh, so with every ninety dollar order of anything mm -hmm. on our or online store, you get to select an item from the celebration catalog. For free. Freezies. There are some items that are a little bit higher in value. So if you spend $180, you can select those as well. But there's some really awesome ones that are available uh, for $90 purchase. And we just happen to be using one today. <laughs> Yay! We like to celebrate celebration. Celebrate celebration. <laughs> um, also, if you would like two free stamp sets. Me. Yes, please. Um, oh, not celebration freeze. Not any any free stamp any. set. Yeah. Um, there's a, the part of the promotion for celebration. It's confusing, but um, there's lots of free things. That's basically what we're saying. Mm -hmm. um, you can join our team. So Kylie's going to put a link in the um, chat. <laughs> in the chat, I will. So um, yeah, you can select two free stamp sets. Are we allowed to talk about the other thing, or is that not yet? Depends which other thing. No, I don't think we can yeah. yet. 
Just in case. Something exciting is happening soon. There's something too. exciting happening. But we've but, already got lots exciting happening now. So um, if you have got a catalog from us in celebration, um, there's a date that it ends. Usually it ends it's just January and February. Mm. Because we had some delays with the shipping. In South Pacific only. Okay, so if, I know we have other uh, markets watching. If you live in Australia or New Zealand, the date for celebration has been extended a few weeks. 16th of March. 16th of March. So, so you get a couple of weeks to collect. A couple extra weeks mm. uh, to collect all of the items. And Carmen Chameleon. <laughs> Carmen Chameleon. Come, 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 Kenzie, can you join our team? We would love to have you join our team. <laughs> First of all, you don't live in our country. Second of all, you're already a demonstrator. <laughs> so, probably not. <laughs> Megan got her pins. Yay! Excellent. Now, speaking of pins. Yes, speaking of pins. <laughs> um, hands up if you just made an order for more pins. Yeah, we did. <laughs> so, yeah. we have quite a bit coming. Um, mm. Of the same pins because they, mm. they they were very popular, very pop, more popular. And than we, we found ever out imagined. how we can ship them outside of Australia yeah. now. So, so we can ship them outside of Australia. We can ship it without tracking, but we don't trust that. Mm. So um, if anybody wants to pay for the shipping and you live in another country, mm. um, that's totally up to you. But we've worked out how to do it. So when they come in, uh, we'll let you know that they're in stock. The pins. Mm. Uh, we just happen to have them here. This yes. one here was the, the most popular one. Yep. Yeah. The little chicken. The little chicken was the most popular. Hold it up a bit, a bit longer. Yeah, look at that one. And the little chickies Chickens next to it. Chickens and the... The mushrooms. The mush... Uh, oh, the, there's Brenna's tree. And it's I thought, Rose Gold. I honestly thought that one would be my popular one. <laughs> Um, excuse me, my love it chocolate. Love it chocolate, yeah. <laughs> it probably was Oops. the most popular, but we had double of the love it chocolate. So, yes, there's a few things. So, yeah. again, just a reminder, celebration is still happening, and it's happening until? 16th of March. March the 16th. So, mm -hmm. you can get free products uh, with every $90 purchase. Mm -hmm. If you want any two free stamp sets, mm -hmm. join our team, and uh, you will be able to select any mm -hmm. two free stamp sets. Choose the most expensive ones. <laughs> We've got a list of expensive ones. Someone did ask how much is shipping for the pins. In another country, it's, it's a $18. lot. It's $18. $18 Australian. However, we've worked out that if you get like five pins, it works out like you can still get it under $10 per pin. We've made the pins really Kyle, the, affordable. Honestly, the way that Kylie calculates that, I'm just like, what? Huh? That's no help. Well, I just want to look at the whole amount. And then divide it by how many you purchase. Right, okay. So add so the shipping you, on and then, yeah. you know, to get the pins under $10 with postage overseas, yeah. I think is pretty good value. And but you, you do you can need buy to like get five, five to ten. Five or ten yeah. and send them to your friends yeah. or um, give them as gifts to your team. Yeah. Um, that would be the yeah. way to do it. Look, it's a lot of money, but mm. we have found that when we're sending things overseas... If we don't have it tracking... I think they there's just... no other way, is there? You have to do tracking. Well, you can do it via Australia Post, but then you just... You oh, like as a letter. Just oh, as a letter. And dodge. pray that it gets there. No. Um. <laughs> <laughs> It'll go through the scanner and be like, goo 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 goo. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> so, good question. Um, so, um, Jen, we have FOMO for pins in yeah. the US. Yes, we're getting coming, them to you, honestly, Jen. We're yeah. getting them to you. If uh, this next it's, batch. Mm. We don't make extra money out of sending them overseas mm. unfortunately <laughs> but um it, we just we want to make sure that they get there we want so. you to all have a love it chop it pin do you, can you show the love it chop it pin it's so cute oh i love it chop it chop it yeah we all love to love it chop it i love to love it chop it don't i love to don't love start it, with chop that. it. um so one other thing <laughs> there was a question about mugs and bags um, watch this space. We have it sort of geared up. We've got some other projects that we're doing at the moment. So once... Um, We've got, we're getting ready for Lisa. Have you all signed up for the Lisa oh event? Oh my goodness. I just did my card this morning and I'm like, this is the one I'm demonstrating. I've got one more left to do and that's I've eight, done all eight of my projects. I'll be quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Enough of you. And You're like, an overachiever. Yeah. But anyway... <laughs> Bruno's project, oh my goodness, even if you sign They're up, all amazing. no, yours is ridiculous. Even Lisa and Gina were like, we'll just all go home now. It's not true. It they are true. all amazing. No, 
It's a, a seriously Bruno's project. I've never seen anything like it. It's an so, architectural. Kylie's going to <laughs> genius. Kylie's going to post a link. <laughs> yeah, if I'll put you it up have now. not um, registered, for, you can't register yet. First of March. First, first of March. March um, yeah. But you can register to get updates about this event. Um, it's going to be a cracker of an event. It really is. And anyone be so from good. anywhere, anywhere in the world, even non-stampin' up countries, um, mm. anywhere in the world can um, sign up for that. Mm. Now, we are going to get started. We have some exciting events. We're going to be crafting, mm. but first of all, we are going to be sharing swaps. <gasps> Our team swaps. Our team swaps. Our so team did so well. Our team... This is another reason. If you want to... Mm. Um, when you get your two... Sign up to get your two free stamp sets, you sign up as a demonstrator. And a part of being a demonstrator, there's lots of things that um, that you are entitled to take advantage of. But one of the things, if you're in our team, we have swaps. Um, and so what that means is you make 10 cards send them to us and we send you 10 different cards <laughs> so you make 10 of the same cards and you get 10 different cards from other demonstrators around the world uh, around australia Australia. Mm. so we are going to go through all of the swaps that we, we received mm. and i am going to make with you all the swap that i made mm. And it's a bit of a take on our favourite stamp set from <laughs> Celebration. <laughs> what? <laughs> We've all got awesome otters. We've all got awesome otters. In Australia. <laughs> but my project is, is it an otter or is it something else? Oh, what is it, Bruno? So, Do tell. Let us face down. Face down, camera down. Bing. Someone say Beverogino. I need a Beverogino. Will you be upset if I make noise or should I do it in the other room? No, you can make noise. Now, is the camera facing down? Is it? Yes, it is. Do I want Do I want the plants? Yes, you want the plants. Do I want lava chocolate? Or I've even got, ooh, I've got the mushrooms. Diana, good question. No, it's not. Sorry. You ha you've had the products the whole time. So it's only extended in South Pacific. Yeah, just so um, in the US, it still ends as advertised on the in the catalog. So just in uh, the Australia and in New Zealand, it's been extended for that period of time. Elaine received the Love It Chop It pin the other day Yay! with her gift. Very good. What did you think of it, Elaine? Isn't it pretty? Yeah, it's very nice, isn't it? Yeah. So the first pin we the first pin the first <laughs> swap that we have is from our team member Joe Reynolds. And she used the um, Hardy Heart. <laughs> I knew you were going to say Hardy Heart. <laughs> the stamp set called Sweet Conversations. Oh, she's done such a great Sweet job. Sweet Conversations. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yep, good. So some nice colours there. And this is a nice little use of the... Yeah, um, the heart. The hearts, which mm, you can see along there. Nice one. Thank you very much for sharing in that, Joe. That's excellent. Now, our next one is what? I love this kite stamp set. What do you think of when you... <laughs> Let's go fly a kite. <laughs> so this was by our awesome team member, Amanda <laughs> Shields, and she used the Kite Delight stamp set. You've got to do fussy cutting, but it's worth it. It's definitely worth it. Yeah. And she also used the um, Marvelous paper, mm. which is something that you can get for free. Uh, let me just take this out because she's got a fancy fold or a fancy card design there. And look at that. What? So that's it's called cool. something like Bridge Span or I don't know what it's called, but that's a really mm. nice design. I there. like that. Thanks for sharing that with I'll us, that Amanda. Thanks, Amanda. All right, wait. You can close it. So, <laughs> this one here is by our team member, Lena Raptus D'Ambrosio. Mm -hmm. And this has something very exciting. Oh. What? Just in the window sheet there. That is beautiful, Lena. Lena. 
She's done a really good job. She said she worked really hard on this. They are beautiful. And so this is mm. using the Heart and Home stamp set. Yeah. All of these stamp sets are available too. Yeah. And she used blends to colour these out in Pale Papaya, Mossy Meadow, Mango Melody. And yeah, very nice. And this DSP is the Heart and Home. So the Heart and Home has some beautiful... Um, the designs that are not like in your face mm. they're like really beautiful and this is one of they're them they're subtle subtle i'm like what's that <laughs> word <laughs> and we know it's subtle everyone it's okay yeah. <laughs> thanks just putting that funny. away you're welcome oh ho, ho, ho. look at this one <laughs> so this is by our team member karen candy and she used that stamp set. You know, these stamp sets are starting to grow on me. I haven't I used know. them yet. Are they growing on me too? I haven't used them yet, but they are... I would are, love to see what you come up with, Bruni. They are really nice. Patty Bennett did some amazing ones of yeah. those. So the stamp set is called In the Moment and Enjoy the Moment. Um, so that must be from Enjoy the Moment. And this is In the Moment. So they're those sketchy type mm. ones there. And I'm pretty sure she used blends. Um, yes, she did. She used blends in bronze, ivory, crumb cake, just jade, soft suede, and pool party. And that's a beautiful colouring that um, Karen did with that re ribbon with evening evergreen. Very nice. Oh, who made this next one here? Who could that be? What? <laughs> And big thank you to everyone who bought the tutorial for this last week. We had lots of new tutorial people. In case you are wondering, this was made by the lovely Kylie Batucci. Kylie Batucci. <laughs> so you untie this. You do. What's it from? Make what sure was... that you put them in the plastic bags, just because so, I haven't. Yes, yep. they're all in. Thank you. Yes. And you Bruno open likes it to up stay like, what? So last week I stepped it up the same as my tutorial bundle and it had that second panel. Now, someone just asked a question about the leaves. That last one that we just looked at. Oh, yes. Where is that from? So, good question. That's this like die one, is um, Birds and More. Birds and More. Oh, yeah. I thought it was a bird one. And Stitch So Sweetly for that one. So this one here is from the Birds and More. Good question, Sue. Thanks for asking that. So this one here is using the um, Hippo and Friends dies for this. This is the Daffodil um, Daydream. And this is from Through It Together. Some beautiful sentiments in Through It Together. Hi, Jennifer. Thanks for stopping by today. And yeah, the paper is, from, is one of the celebration items that you can get for free. With a $90 purchase. Oh, yes. I love free. And this one here, um, if I was going to choose a favourite item from Celebration, I think this paper is it. What is it? Oh, yeah. That paper is gorgeous. We just got another one yesterday. Sure did. So this is the one that I did last week, everyone, in case you missed it. So you can go back to last week's YouTube. And I've just popped up a link. Well, what? I'm going to put up a link. What's happening there, the Kylie? the tutorial bundle. I used, what? <laughs> I used it with the what was the bundle we used last month? Artfully, com artfully uh, no, composed. No. Yeah, artfully yeah. composed. Yeah. So just tutorial bundle, artfully composed. If you want to know how to make that card, you can head over to that link there and grab that tutorial bundle. Thanks for that, Kylie. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Dolores, for joining us. So there is Kylie's. One of Kylie's swap. What? Yeah, I did two different types. Here's a beautiful one using the Artfully Composed. This is by our team member, Shirley Taylor. Shirley's from Paper very Doll Design. good card Do maker. Look at her? Yep. Um, Artfully Layered, Biggest Wish are the stamp sets that are used. So this one here, the sentiment there. Um, I'm going to take it out. Sorry. Yeah, do it's it. It's a bit reflective. I can, no, I can put it away for you. Oh, thank you, Randy. I'm glad you enjoyed last week's card. Um, so, yeah, she used the Artfully Layered stamp set. Look at how beautiful she's done it on that. Yeah, it looks so good. So it looks good. like she's done the stamp and then some daubering or blending brushes over the top. Mm -hmm. And then she's cut out the Artfully Love Layered. Love the colours, um, Tropical too. layers. 
Very nice colours. And a nice there. border too. I love that border. Now, in case you were wondering, the colours are polished pink, granny apple green, coastal cabana, and grey granite. Where's the grey? Oh, yeah, that little... What do you call there. polished pink? Polish pink. <laughs> from Poland. It's from Poland. <laughs> now, I have photographed all of these. So, if you want to look at them a bit closer, um, in today's blog post, I'm going to... Ooh, is that your mission for That's today? My mission. In today's blog post, I'm going to edit those photos and Yay. I'll post them, them with a link to this video. So, Yay. Our next one is from... So then from you can pin them to Pinterest and get inspo. Pin interest. Pin interest. <laughs> this one here is from our team member. P.S. It's not pin interest, it's everyone. It's not pin interest, yeah. <laughs> you know. Just in case they've been calling it pin interest. <laughs> this is from Pinterest. our team member. Can I have the... Yeah, I'll keep this. I'll no, keep I want to read it. Oh, sorry. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is from our team member, Sue Hack. The stamp set she used is Positive Thoughts. The die set is Nature's Thoughts. And of course, she's used the stitched rectangle dies. There. Stitched rectangle dies. And used basic white and pale papaya. Very Beautiful. nice. Thank you very much, Sue. Beautiful card there. Pale papaya it has grown on me. It's, yeah. Like, even in, in, on my card, I did not think I would ever use pale papaya. And since that daffodil paper came, I'm like... I want to use the ribbon and the cardstock. I really love it. Donna Hepburn used, uh, she bought the Artfully Composed last night. Oh, very good. Okay. Ugh. It's a great bundle, that one. But there's lots of really good ones there to choose from. So, here is another one from our team member, Tristan Dawes. Thank you, Tristan. Beautiful um, card. I haven't used this one yet, either. No, it looks great. So, this is the Paradise Palms stamp set with the Palms dies. Mm. And she's used uh, Old Olive. <laughs> I think um, she used Autocorrect on the... <laughs> Why, what does it say? <laughs> the ink colour is Sarah Sands. <laughs> Sounds like a name. <laughs> Sahara Sand. <laughs> Sarah Sands. Sahara Sand, Crumb Cake, I Old Olive, Mossy Meadow, Pale Papaya, and Memento Black. Beautiful card there, Tristan. Thank you very much for that. I like this. This layout is, is one of my favourites at the moment. With the panel in the middle going mm, from top to bottom. That is nice. Very nice, Tristan. Oh, it's nice, it's different, it's unusual. Glad you're enjoying it, Betty. <laughs> yeah, it's good to get all this inspiration. And as Bruno said, we'll put it on our blog, kylievertucci.com. And I'll put up our newsletter, actually. If you want to receive all our blog updates, you will need to go over to our newsletter, even if you're signed up. can they? Do they need, like, an update link, or can they just go there and if they've already signed up? Okay, good question. So if you... Um already receive our newsletter just go to the bottom of one of the newsletter don't click on subscribe click on um, <laughs> update your preferences or something like that yeah. and that will take you to a website where you can select uh, we have four different newsletters that you can receive and one of them is update um, blog, updates. blog updates so and I only send them weekly so you're not going to get spammed mm. um, but it means you won't miss anything we put on our blog yeah. So this one here is by the lovely Lady Helen Mead. Oh, Lady Helen. Lady Helly. <laughs> so this is using celebration items. So with a $180 purchase, you can get a bundle that includes this amazing paper as well as this stamp set. I love that bundle. Friendly Hello. It's Friendly Hello, isn't it? Yeah, yep. Friendly oh, Hello. Hel yeah, Friendly Hello. Yeah. Um, so yeah, the paper is amazing and you get the stamp set as well mm. for free, for free, free. for free. <laughs> um, using that home, heart and home, um, circle doilies, doilies. doilies. I'm like, what are they called? <laughs> Very nice lady Helly. Very nice. Kylie Joe, is there another swap from you? Well, here you go, Deborah. Here's an interactive card for you. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, this is Kylie's other swap. 
I did the same same one, but I just changed up the paper. Changed the paper. I really love that paper this, so much. Yeah, I'm gonna miss it goes it really nice it, together when it goes. And I did some blends at the front. Um, if you don't have your hands on the hippo and friends dies. Yeah, these <gasps> ones here. Seriously, they are the best dies. I very use them good. all the time. They're my go-to. Yeah. So hippo and friends dies. If there's anything you're going to get after today, it's them. Yeah. Very nice. Thank you very much, Kylie Batucci. Thank you. Here's another card from our team member. Chris Arthurs. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Chris. And this is using the marvellous paper. I love this paper. This is also another item that you can get for free with a $90 purchase. Uh, this stamp set is the Daffodil Daydream Bundle. So um, she stamped that and then coloured it using blends, I guess. Yes, stamp yeah, and blends. Yeah, like blends. It's beautifully coloured. Thank I you very much for flowers. that, Chris. Mm. With the... Oh, is that... Oh, there's a... Ooh, look at that. I didn't notice that. So it has the vellum down here, the layered... Um, vellum layering designs. So you can see that there in this little panel there. Oh, so it goes all the way. It's I didn't smart. notice that the first time. Mm. So the vellum goes all the way, just with this panel of the Marvelous paper. Hi Kayleen, thanks for joining us today. Hi! Friendly nice. Hello is your favourite, is Elaine. It is gorgeous, isn't it? Hi Samantha, so how are you? So pretty. Good day, Samantha. So this is from the amazing Cheryl Hurst. She's such a sweetie, Cheryl. She sent... I don't know how many cards she's up to now, but she went around in her neighbourhood and dropped off all these Love It Chop It cards to her people in her neighbourhood. Hundreds of them. She's a darling. Yeah. So, thank you, Cheryl, for this beautiful swap. She used the L Hello Ladybug bundle. Look at that. That's so cool. It's very cool, isn't it? And the colours are, in case you were wondering, Polish pink. <laughs> and granny apple green Sarah Sands <laughs> Sarah Sands, yeah Not Sahara Sands <laughs> What is it? What's the granny apple green, is it? Yeah Oh, yeah Donna I love Polish Pink I really like it I did message her this morning Okay I'm sure you'll hear from uh, the demonstrator you purchased that from, Donna So, and this paper here Is it paper or did she stamp that? It looks like she might have stamped it Really? Um, a oh, sweet talk DSP. Yeah, I was gonna say it looks familiar. Oh, oh no needies! No needies. <laughs> That's great. Hope you get the job, Caitlin. Oh, that'd be great, Caitlin. You can do some more shopping. <laughs> <laughs> She's only just had her first Stampin' Up order of the year arrive this week. I'm like, that self control. She <laughs> said, No, nah, I just don't have any money. <laughs> Thank you, Cheryl. It was Cheryl, yes. I just say eat baked beans. You've got to have priorities. <laughs> the stamping comes first. <laughs> this is the amazing Lorraine Morgan. Thank you very much for participating in the swap, Lorraine. So Lorraine used the Daisy Lane stamp set with the Daisy Punch and some Parisian Flourish 3D embossing folder. Can you see that in the it's background? Very nice. I haven't used that folder in a while. It was nice for her to bring that up, bring that back. That's some um, annual catalog, isn't it? That, yeah. That folder. And what's where's that one from? Um, it's probably from the same one as the yeah, Daisy. Yeah, I think so too. The color that she has used is. It looks like Calypso Coral. Calypso Coral, yeah. yeah. And Crust Curry. Mm, what a combo! Very nice. Thank Very you. Very nice. And pear pizzazz for the. Him. This one is from our team member Janelle Duggan. This is the Pootles. Hi, Sam. Pootles million dollar stamp set. Or is it two million? I can't one keep million. up. <laughs> they only get one million now. Oh, really? Yep. Ah. So the stamp set is called Dahlia Days. Dahlia Days. I think that's a hello. Mm -hmm. Or something else, maybe. And the other one <laughs> is called Sentimental Swirls. Diana likes my eat baked beans. Priorities, oh, people. <laughs> 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 so 
Some of you probably don't know what baked beans are. Do we only have them in Australia? <laughs> no, they're probably called something else. <laughs> Garbanzo beans or something. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you very much, Janelle. Now, actually, I just saw a comment from Callan Daz, and it made me think of Kazaz. If anyone is watching and you are form were formerly a Kazaz consultant. consultant we would love to have you join our team. Yeah, we're very sad. Very for sad you for you, but um, we would happily. Um... <laughs> Stampin' Up! People learn from this, and make sure you go shopping. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want we don't want anything to happen to Stampin' Up! Would be so sad. But yeah, big hugs to all of you, Kazaz peeps. So this yeah. is from our team member, C Ward. I think it's Christine, if I'm not mistaken. And this is again using the friendly hello. Um, bundle that you can get for free with a $180 purchase. Cha -ching! <laughs> very nice, friendly hello. Thank you very much for that. Glad you like the pins, Margaret. So, this is from our team member, Megan Lecornu. I'm going to take this out of the bag because this is it's pretty It's really special. cool, this one. Megan did two cards. She, she did, did a two really swaps, good job. Yeah. So, this is using the Amazing Silhouettes um, bundle. Stamp set. It's the bundle, that's right. Yeah. Amazing Silhouettes, yeah. So, it has the Amazing Silhouettes, but it also has these amazing words. And I love how she's done the two layers. The mm. dies come in, like, each word has two layers. So, you can have the, um, the actual letter, and then there's a shadow. That's really nice. We really love, love that. And so in the background, it looks like she's done some daubering and then stamped with the Knight of Navy over the top. That's what she did. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or maybe the other way around. Yeah, I think she stamped first, then did the daubering. Yeah. Because then you wouldn't know where what, to where it starts and where it ends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, the pins, Margaret, the pins are on our Shopify store. So I'm sure Kylie will put I'll a link somewhere. Link. Yeah. But uh, at the moment, we have very limited stock. And at the moment, I think we've only opened it to Australia. Yeah, but we haven't done when the, the next, rest. When the next shipment comes, we'll open mm. it to everyone. Yeah. Thank you, Megan. This is from our team member, Sue Vine. But as long as you're signed up for our newsletter, Margaret, you'll get all the updates when the pins yeah. arrive. Now, Sue also used um, the Friendly Hello bundle. So, um, that looks amazing there. But she also used this really nice Bloom Hybrid Embossing Folder. So, that's not a part of the bundle, but this is in the annual catalogue, and it's... Look, I'm just going to go out and say it. It was designed to coordinate with that. Mm, totally. Look how exactly the same it it's is. It's the same flower. Did any of you know that? I did not know that till Brennan pointed it out. He found it. <laughs> I discovered it. He did. He <laughs> discovered it. <laughs> Very nice, Sue. Yeah, I love the... Like, you can colour that or you can just leave it plain. It's, it's beautiful either way. Mm. Very nice. Thank you very much, Sue Vine. This one is from the uber talented Jessica Hart. And Jessica's great. Jessica used the Paradise Palms stamp set. The Palms dies. This this thing here, this um, die here is beautiful. I can't wait to use that. Layering circles dies, and the simply marvelous paper. Look how beautiful it looks. It looks like you're looking through a pool. Um, I like it. Really pretty. And can we just talk about the layering of this card? Mm. Like the natural inclination would be to center this, but look how effective it is mm. to just put it on the side like that. Beautiful. Yep. Really nice. Very nice, Jessica. Thank you very much for that. She's a bit of a smarty pants, that <laughs> one. She does really cool reels and stuff. Yes. This one here is also from Megan Lacornu. Megan did two swaps. So, she's 
She did two sets of 10 cards, so she received 20, 20. different cards in return. Yep. Which is why I, I would join our team double. just for that. <laughs> <laughs> just for the swaps. <laughs> so this is using the home and garden bundle. I really want to use this. Um, so maybe... Oh, Megan's here. Megan! Megan. Hello! Megan. Megan's in the house, everybody. Give Megan some love. <laughs> I love this. This is awesome. Yeah. I love the... the um, what are they called? Tools? The tools and the tool shed. But I love the use of the brick and mortar mm. 3D embossing folder. Yeah. Very effective, Megan. Yeah. So this is like the side of the shed. What would you call a shed in um, the US? Is it a shed? Garage. Gar uh, maybe garage. Like garage. Garage. <laughs> garage. <laughs> what do you call the place where you... Tool I think it's a tool shed. It would be a tool shed. Yeah. Maybe the greenhouse. They'd say something like that. What was that place where they, um, the chateau, and they had like a... Orangerie. Could, orangerie. Orangerie, yeah. <laughs> It'll be something like that. It's the old orangerie. <laughs> so in answer to your question, Roxanne, they were a direct sales company, but they the company has um, moved away from direct sales. Mm. So they will just be direct to consumer. So... She shed. <laughs> she shed, yeah. I like that. Tool shed, yeah. Tool shed, garden shed, yeah. <laughs> Just the way that we say it, it sounds like shed. an Australian word. A shed. <laughs> Garage. <laughs> so the cardstock is Pear Pizzazz. I've been using Pear Pizzazz quite a bit lately. Um, and up until then, I have... I don't remember ever using it. <laughs> There's a few colours we've started using differently. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. Pale papaya I never thought I'd love, but... So um, Megan coloured this with blends. Well done, Megan. Thank you for participating. And yes, um, um, Susan said, that's so cool. I struggle with masculine cards, don't we all? So I think that's great. This one here. Ooh. Oh, very nice. I love the masks. This is by... So the good thing about being participating in the swap is that we have a requirement that they're normal size cards, <laughs> just so that we can post them back. Mm. Um, and it's good because we can either use them or send them on to some send other them people. on to someone. Yeah. Now this is by the amazing Kylie Curry. Kylie used the masks, which have a special name: butterflies and flowers layering mask. I love the way that she's mm. done this. And has she used two different colours or the same colour? I think I. I think she's Soft used succulent two. ink pad yeah. and evening evergreen yeah, yeah. ink pad. Yeah, yeah. laid it with another colour. Very nice layering there. Mm. And this is from the... And these masks are so affordable. They like, are. They're a really good price. And look how effective they are. If you need are. to stamp... You just need some of the brushes. Oh, gold embossing. It looks really yeah, good. Yeah, it looks That's great. from Best Year Stamp Set. And the stitched rectangle dies. Effective use of those. Thank you very much. I think um, Megan actually fussy cut those dies, didn't she? I think they are... Oh, no, they dies. have dies. No, they have dies. They That's have right. dies, yep. It is part of a bundle. Yeah. Good question, Deborah. For the shed tools, that is, Deborah. Yeah. This is from Jasmine Jones. Now, I didn't keep... Jasmine actually... Yes, can we just note, say something before we move on? Yes. <clears throat> Kylie has included a Stampin' Up! envelope. How many of you actually use the Stampin' Up! envelopes? I'm very interested in this because people don't realise how affordable and gorgeous. They are very nice. They are like no other envelope. We know straight away when it's not Stampin' Up! <laughs> and what do you do, Bruno? I'm like, just buy the Stampin' Up! envelopes. <laughs> he goes, oof! Like, because it's just... It, like, they are beautiful. They, they are have, beautiful. They have a, a They're waxy like feel. silky... You can stamp on them. They're yeah. they're really high high quality. I wouldn't say that they are. Oh, sorry. That's alright. Just leave it. Yep. You um, wouldn't say they. I are. wouldn't say that they are waterproof, mm. but they assist mm. um, because they are. Mm. They're not. 
I mean, water does get through. Like sometimes in a. Yeah. I I just do the bags now. We do a bag, yeah. Either over the front or inside, but they are just they're beautiful. So beautiful. Please do yourself a favor if you don't get the Stampin' Up envelopes, just get one pack and and have a look at the difference. Yeah. Yeah. We yeah. Just if you participate FYI. in the swap next time, you don't have to give us an envelope. That was very generous of Thank you, Carly. Thank yes, you very much. Yes, we appreciate that. <laughs> yeah. Yes, they are silky. I love that. They're silky to the touch. I don't... Oh, that's that. Yes, yes. Now, Jasmine... Sorry to sorry to interrupt that's there, That's okay. <laughs> Jasmine actually did five of this card in one colour and five in another colour. That's permitted. <laughs> Because it's basically the same design. She did one in Bermuda Bay, I think it was. And one in Magenta, is it? Yeah, Magenta Madness. Oh, Just Jade. The other one was in Just Jade. Mm -hmm. So she used the Sweet Conversation stamp set and the Sweet Hearts dies. And that's... This is a beautiful... This I really like this type of card where you use um, the same colour in mm. all different um, ways. Mm. Uh, what's it called? Is it monochrome? But yeah. even yeah, like yeah, yeah. <coughs> so that's nice. And Very the nice. last swap. Whose swap haven't we seen yet? <gasps> Yours. I think. Which is going to be today's card? This we're is the card together. we're making today. Ta da! Ta -da! So, I use the awesome otter, but is it an otter or is it a porcupine <laughs> or an echidna? <laughs> it could be an echidna too, that's true. <laughs> what have I used? So, I used, of course, the awesome otter stamp set. I used the Bragworthy for the um, sentiment. Mm -hmm. The dies I used are... Can anybody guess which dye this is? Monochromatic. Monochromatic. Yes, that's the one. Tone on tone. 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 Yes. <laughs> Can you swap that sure. away, please? <laughs> <laughs> go away. Thank there you. There we go. <laughs> um, yes. What else have you used? What else have I used? Oh, the paper is yeah. um, artfully <laughs> composed. And this dye, has anybody... Have you worked out the die? Worked out the die. <laughs> and this is oh, the... Oh, I didn't use... The, I didn't show which... It's the bark. You didn't bark, put it in. Yeah. Mm. So, it's the... Tropical Layers die. So, it's this one here. <laughs> yes, it's very cute. <laughs> now, you might think, does an otter or does, does a porcupine or does a echidna Kidna. actually look like that? Because we often see them you know, walking and they look like their spikes go out, but they actually... They do look similar. They do look very similar. Yeah. So, I mean, we are, allow for artistic license on this. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Jan, the artfully composed dyes. So, yeah. the tropical layers dyes. <laughs> so, let's make it. Yay! Do you want me to get the bark dye for you? Um, or you eventually we'll get that. We'll just cut the cardstock and right. stuff. So, first of all, let's... Um, actually, what you can do... Yes. Can you... Do some fussy colours? cutting. Thank you very much. So, Bruno's already stamped some. I wasn't going to show that. <laughs> <laughs> Look how organised you are. Um, okay. So, let us, first of all, I've got... I want to use some... This is going to... Oh, and here's another version of the same card that I made. Um, I don't know where I put the other one. Oh, this one here. Yeah, I like the different paper. So I made basically the same card, just with different paper. Mm. And we are going to choose today which paper we're going to use. Okay? Ooh. So I've already cut these. Uh, these are basically the card front size. So we've got this one. We've got this one. We've got this one. And we've got this one. So I've got one that I think I would like to use, but let's go majority rules okay do we want option one option, option two, two option three, three or, or option, option four, four. Ooh. <laughs> can you pass me the cattle dog please the cattle dog and what's that um black thing there that was what the swaps were in ah, okay 
just I'll pop them back in there. Thank you very much. So what just do you think, people? Just give me space over there. And the reason why I'm asking is because can you move your camera up a bit, please? Which one? This one? No, it's alright. That's okay. It's, it looks good. One. Oh, lots of twos. It lots might be of that ones. one that they can't see properly. So bring that over. Let go. Ah, okay. Let go. Yeah, there we go. Sorry. There we go. Okay, so lots of ones, one, lots two, of twos. One, two, three. Oh, we'll oh. put that over there. Three, four. Okay. Oh, two's looking very twos. popular. I actually was thinking three would be Were popular. You? Oh, no, I like two as well. Okay, let's make two. Yeah, I really like Lots two. of ones, lots of twos. Let's do one and two. Yeah. So. I like that. What colour card base are we going to use? So for this one, let's make this one in Evening Evergreen. Mm -hmm. And let's make this one in Just Jade. Ooh. So, first of all, I'll just cut the card base, and um, the card base is half of a card, half of a piece of cardstock. So, in whichever um, country, oh, it's not back to front. <laughs> it's not necessarily back to front. It's just the way I like it. Okay. <laughs> I clean my um, trimmer every one. Yes, I noticed did that. Did you see me cleaning it I the did. other night? I did, I was very impressed. I used um, alcohol, not gin. I wouldn't waste gin that way. And so then <laughs> all I'll do, so um, these are the two cards that I'm going to make. How are you going with that fussy cutting, Kylie? Oh, sorry, I forgot about that. <laughs> So I will just score these two. I feel like I'm meant to be doing something. <laughs> in half. Make sure I don't cut it because Kylie put them on back to front. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to be gaslit, all right? <laughs> There's no such thing as right or wrong. It's just how you feel. The link to the sign up for email doesn't work. Really? Yeah. Oh. Someone just subscribed. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Kathy S. Maybe, you can try <laughs> maybe try it on a different browser, Kathy. So I'm just going to burnish this. And if you don't think it works, I can tell you. Victoria just signed up. Thanks, Victoria Parker. It really does work. It, it really does it work. It really does work. And it's a beautiful fold. Just try that one again. I don't. I actually don't use the edge. I use just the side like oh, that. Oh, do you? Yeah. Ah. It's a beautiful, beautiful cut. I love cut. the Just Jane. So that's going to be really nice. Actually, I'm going to do something that I said that I really like at the moment. Rather than going from full width, I am going to do the strip on the side. Ah, oh, that's cool. Yeah. So I'm just going to cut an edge. <coughs> um, it's five mil. What should I do? I think about eight centimeters. Eight millimeters. Oh, like at eight centimeters. Oh. Like it's at ten, isn't it? It's ten and a half now. Oh, but so I was thinking full, nine oh, yeah. and a half. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's do nine and a half. We can always go smaller. You can't go larger. No. Because <laughs> that will really just, and I'll use that on the inside. Nice solutioning, everybody. You you just say to be like me. I've got it all planned. Now let's change it. <laughs> <laughs> it's called so, creative license. In case you were wondering what I was just doing, I just cut this down so that you could see the card so color of the cardstock underneath. I think that's nice. What do you think, people? I can't get a clean fold <laughs> with the bone. Charlotte, I have my blades arranged that way too, Kylie Petucci. <laughs> is this is this like a Fold over or fold under? <laughs> Toilet paper. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just yes. do that then. Do whatever you like. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that. Thank you, everybody, for bullying me into doing that. Not that you bullied me. <laughs> so, what can we do next? Um, let's have a look at the card. So, let's fold... Let's cut these things out. Now, um, as Kylie mentioned, I'd already pre-cut the... 
uh, pre-stamped the Arters. I actually wanted to try them in um, two colours. One is in cinnamon cider and the other one is will be in... Is this <clears> early espresso? Early espresso. <laughs> it's not espresso. It's not espresso. You're hurting my feeling. So, actually we'll use one of each. So Kylie's just cutting the other one. But while she... All I did was I stamped using Versamark and then heat embossed using white embossing powder. Now, embossing still excites me. Actually, let's do it. Do it. I want to show you how exciting it is. If you're new to this channel, thank you very much for watching. Um, Please subscribe. Smash the subscribe <laughs> smash button. Smash the subscribe button. <laughs> Hit that like button. Um, now where, okay, I'll just use this one. Oh, that's so cute. There you go. Thank There's you very much. One. So we've got them. Do you just need one? I think that's okay. Yeah. So I'm going to use an Are embossing pillow. Are you using pillow. an entire A4 sheet? We have scraps. Jesse will not be impressed with you, Bruno Batucci. So I'm going to stamp it using, um, first, sorry, the embossing pillow. If you would like that, Kylie's just going to I'm post gonna a link. I'm going to get the link. Stampin' Up! doesn't sell them anymore, but we have some of them available in our Shopify store. Not in our Stampin' Up! store, in our separate Shopify store. And it just gets rid of the static because we don't want the emboss... We only want the embossing powder to stick where we've stamped. And we found... Sadly, it's only Australia, everyone. Maybe now that we've tried overseas shipping, we might be able to add them to overseas. Maybe. Mm. Watch this space. Watch this space. So it looks like nothing. Well. A hundred and fifty-three people watching. What? Okay. I'm like, I can't use that because you have writing on it. <laughs> No, have a look at your maths equation. We were doing uh, we were doing grade one. five maths equations <laughs> the other night. <laughs> it was a very difficult maths equation. I was like, nah, not even going to attempt that. Just note to self, people, try not to use embossing powder with a fan on. Is that clear? That looks like clear. What? Huh. I, f I f take that back. It looks very clear. Now, so, something happened. As you can see, everybody. Can you see the halo? That was because I pressed too hard and it... But never mind. We're going, to be chop, we're going to be chopping anyway. I if use my take your pick tool. The scratchy end. It well, you do that then. It works a treat. You do that then, Kylie. <laughs> so then I'm going to use a heat tool this heat tool is amazing if you don't have one buy it from our online store <laughs> and every time I emboss I still get excited everybody every single time look at it look at it so exciting look at it He's got a little belly mark. <laughs> well, he does too. <laughs> he pushed a bit too hard in his belly. But it actually looks quite cute. It looks very cute. <laughs> I designed it that way. <laughs> it was meant to happen. <laughs> That's very cool. Yeah, we're at 62 likes so far. I think the record we've had is about 200. I think we can get there. So, I'm just going to cut that out. <gasps> Look. <laughs> no, you've got to go like this. <laughs> like that. <laughs> and have the music. Na, 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 na. So, what I'm going to do with this one, I'm going to have um, the spikes in cinnamon cider. And in this one, I can have the spikes in 
that colour. Early espresso. Early espresso. <laughs> so again, if you miss that, it's from the Tropical Layers Dyes. Hi, Connie. Welcome. First time here. First time live too. So it's this is the exciting. one we're going to use. <clears throat> Kylie Jo, yeah. can I use the mini skim today, please? Oh, well, Elena's here. Elena Rose, mini skim, it is coming. Welcome to our channel. We've got a few new ones. Is there other new ones lurking? Feel free to say g'day. So, I'm going to use the back of this because Kylie harassed me for using non-scraps. <laughs> it wasn't harassment. It was just... Good use of resources. Okay. So. So. I'm just going to cut this down so it fits. P.S. everyone. The mini stamp and cut and emboss machine is the cutest ever. And I'm shocked that Bruno has requested to use it. Because you hated it. I did hate it. But he I was very know. mean to the mini skim. He was like, that is ridiculous. What is it? What is that even going to do? I said it's going to look really good on my shelf. <laughs> okay, so that fits, does it? Three inches it is. Three inches? Yep. Three inches is what you need your paper. So it's very good if you have scrap paper to use with the mini skim, or you can cut it down to three inches. Yeah. Like I'm doing... If it's slightly too, too big, three inches is your, is your goal post. Okay. <laughs> gentle <it>. persuasion <laughs> so um i think i just need to wow look how clean these are i know they're new so i'll just put the cut one down the bottom the scratch plate is that what it's called i heard someone say that the other night and i was like oh okay have a scratch plate i'm like is there what meant to be one that's scratched and one not <laughs> Ooh, how can I do that so that it... Welcome, prune, prune. <laughs> can the 150 watching please hit the like button? <laughs> it really is the best. I know. It... Now, you can... Like, Bruno finds it jumps, right? But I think you're manhandling it. Yeah. I think you're being too strong with it. It's actually... Yeah. It's actually not that. It doesn't move that much for me. Oops. <clears throat> you just hit the microphone. Sorry, people. Rock a microphone. In stereo with the freestyle. Look <laughs> at Aww. that. Look at the little porcupine echidna spikes. You're making poison spikes. Is the echidna spike Can I just poisonous? say also that this also helps. Some some have found that it's yeah um, it's difficult to push through, but this is how I like to use stacking it as well. Stacking it. Just stacking them. Back, um, back a little bit. Stagger. Stagger it. Jagger it. Think. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> Did it crack? Uh, no, it went right down the edge. Oh. Because I had the bottom Oh, one. right. I was like, what's that noise? Let's do that live. <laughs> Maybe not staggering so, so much. much yes. <laughs> Just slightly. <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. That way. Hey, Patricia. Ah, Cindy, nice to see you here. <laughs> it looks so cute on the shelf. It really does, Mandy. <laughs> we all buy mini. Like in Australia, we had like what were they called? Mini shopping products and we all went crazy for them collecting the little mini collectibles oh the coles the ones. coles ones yeah. yeah we love anything that's mini it's very cute yeah there's another one okay so now let's do two of those in um the cinnamon 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 <laughs> it's another word for a Different word? Simonin? Synonym? <laughs> Synonym? <laughs> forwards and backwards, forwards and backwards. <clears throat> oh, I will need another piece of... Uh, 
Does yep. this mini have a have one of those three D embossing it does. plates as well? It does. Oh, but the other one won't fit in, so I'll have to use the. But digit. they don't have three D. I don't think in the mini. No, but the die is wider than this, so I'll have to use the maxi. You have to go for the big one, the bark. Yeah, bark remedies. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Let me get that for you. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> Can you say hello to my friend Dala? Dala, hello. Look at this, everyone. Oh, so cute. Good morning, Kay Bellet. Good morning, Charlotte Marek. Good morning, Charlotte's friend, Darla. Hi, Darla. Or Darla. Darla. We'll say it in the Aussie way. Darla. Darla. <laughs> very nice so i'm just going i'm just putting pushing through these bits that are in the middle mm -hmm. there we are and this one just talk among yourselves while i do this <laughs> we are I'm looking on crook I oh, Darla just said hello oh that's nice I'm on crook I do for looking for the focaccia recipe so basically all we're going to do is we're going to put these two behind the we can do it like that or we can do the mirror image oh we have to do the ground but this is where we are right now. What do you think of my colour selections, people? I love it. They're a bit different. You're very out there with your colours. You do colours I would never ever think of. I'm a bit too conservative, I think I feel. Now That's the so ground. Cool. I use cinnamon cider for the ground, so maybe I'll do the opposite on each of them. That's a good idea. Um, do I have a piece of cinnamon cider? Well, you've got this one now. <laughs> you've already started that one. <laughs> and so how big do I do it down the bottom? I think about three centimetres. Three and a half. Three and a half. Or about an inch, isn't it? Or an inch and a bit. <coughs> So I'll use that did one. Did you just chop, <laughs> chop the otter? I did. Chop it. Daddy. <laughs> just, I did scab something. Yes, I'm using a whole sheet. <gasps> I'll let you. Thanks. You work hard. Okay, so everybody, just talk among yourselves while I emboss these. I'll, I'll jump in here and I'll share I'll share the focaccia recipe with all of you. Hi there, everyone. Do you come here very often? <laughs> so, um, what did I want to tell you? Um, you wanted to tell everybody that you didn't put everything back in alphabetical order. What? What didn't I put in alphabetical order? Oh my goodness, where is the back in order? <laughs> It's somewhere on the bench. It's over there on the right. I saw it on the right there. Yeah. Yeah. Do you need me? Do you need me to come in and save the day? Oh my goodness. <laughs> There's literally barely anything on the bench. There's so much drama okay. happening over here. Forget that. I'm, I'm going to use this. What? You're not going to use Barky? No. What are you going to use? Stripes. It's similar. Stripes. It's very similar. Look at this, everybody. It's called Stripes and Splatters. Oh, and we didn't show Debbie's um, little box, too. I'll put that here for us to show at the end. That's very cute. Um, actually, you know what happened to the bark? It got put back 
it's not in the spot. <gasps> what? So stripes. I'm. I don't know if it's three D. It looks three D. So let's. Um. So we have. Do you want that one? No. <clears throat> what would you like? Um. Do you mean no? Thank you. So we need a one. <laughs> Then we need this. Then we need this. And then we need a... No, we don't need that. We need a... Yes, one and three. A one and three. Well, that's cool that you're using your little mini again. Yeah, there's other things on the other one too. What's on the other one? Ah, oh, that's alright. I don't know if I've used the right sandwich. It says one and then three. Not the plastic in between. Oh yeah, that yeah. That's right. Yep. Okay. And then just stagger it a little bit there. That's it. Which um, embossing folder is it? Oh, and you've got to do it at the the close needs to be at the, the part that goes in. Yeah, that's what I did. Try that again, because I think you have it the other way around. Hmm. Just use the bigger one, because I have control over that. <laughs> Let me try that one. Let's do a woman's touch. I've got the woman's touch. Ah, oh, it's gone. You've taken it away from me. <clears throat> and this goes through. Oh yeah, this is like this one. Butter. This one's actually a little bit warped. I reckon that's what's causing it. So you probably could even flip these around just to make sure. Oh, that looks great. Bark. Which one did you choose, actually? What's this one? Stripes. Stripes. Oh, I like that one. Okay. Thank nice. you. Nice. Thank you. I want to test it now. <coughs> Thank you. So I'll cut these again. Sorry, everybody. I was prepared. I promised. Hey, we're not going anywhere. We're just chilling with you. Yeah, I'll just do it to the edge like that. Stripes must be like a 3D one. Yeah, that's a 3D sandwich yeah. that we did. Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh. Huh. Oh. No, it was nine and a half that I cut. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Nah, stand embossing folder. Wrong. Wrong one. I'm like, I know that this is user error. I just have to prove it. Because I know my little skim and my skim knows me. So it's actually number four for a lot for embossing folders. 3D, 3D embossing folders. Yeah, you were using number three. Great. Just so that we know everything is okay with my mini. Don't blame the mini. Look at this. Ready? <laughs> so that one has okay got it this is what we're doing people and we'll do the opposite yeah love it that's cool okay let's assemble everyone assembling <clears throat> what would you like? 
that's okay. So I'll just use some Tombow. Mm -hmm. Night, Nessa. <clears throat> So we've shown this tip a few times, but let's show it again. We use the stemperatus just to get a straight edge. So if the bottom is there, if it's the same size, you can do it up in the corner, um, but it's we're just going to be centering that. So at least we can put the straight edge against the bottom. Very nice, and we can also do the same thing there. One and four, Kathy. <clears throat> one and four. We had one and three, so it's just one and four. Because the stripes is a 3D. So, um, Patricia. Good question. Good Patricia. question. So this is what it is at the bottom. And there's also plastic on your trimmer, people. Did you all know that? So you just do this, <laughs> Patricia. Just like that. Where the Stampin' Up! logo is, pull it out. Pull it out. Yeah. Don't pull the Stampin' Up! logo, just pull this out. Yeah. So there's that one. Cute. Let's do the other one now. This is such a cute card, Bruno. Um, which way does it go? Oh, it goes both ways, so it doesn't really matter. Mm. But let's do it that way. <laughs> Just because, 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 because. <laughs> we push that in. I do push like that, that tip. That's good. Honestly, the straight edge, because yeah. it drives me crazy if it's not straight. You are an architect at heart. <laughs> if it's not straight, what happens when you're an architect? I pull it down. The building falls down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm hap, hap, happy with that. I'm very happy with that too. I really like those colours. Very nice. Now, let's get some dimmies. Dimmies! <laughs> <laughs> I've been in this craft room and Bruno's making fun of me because there's mess the everywhere. stuff everywhere. <laughs> what did you just put away without putting the lid on? Oh, it's good without the lid. <laughs> okay, so... Let's stick these together. <laughs> How do you live with me? You're a very patient man. So basically we want it to go <laughs> like that. So let's do this. Turn it over. Keeping it all together. Grab a dimmy. <laughs> when he says dimmy, it's dimensionals. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick it down <laughs> with the dimensional people. Whoa. Look. That's profound. It stays there. It stays there. So now I'm just going to put a few other dimensionals there. And that should not move. So room for another one. Yeah. Hmm. It didn't copy the link for... What do you think of that, people? That is so cute. I'll do the same thing for this. Like 
that. Switcheroo. What a great tip using the Stamparatus for assembly. Honestly, it's yeah. it's, it's really so helpful. Handy. And particularly like when you're putting things the same so the same um the same um size as each other like mm. it's really hard and if um your choice of adhesive mm. is stamp and seal, seal. Mm. you don't have that wiggle room that you do with um that few seconds of wiggle room to do mm. to move things around as you do with um tombow mm. and so you want it to be accurate the first time you put it down so <laughs> What? Everyone's laughing at how many dimensionals you're using. <laughs> Someone called you the Pop Doc King. Pop Doc. <laughs> okay. I think that's enough. You think that's enough? <laughs> okay. Let's stick that down. <laughs> if you haven't tried the foam... No, what are they called? The foam sheets? Foam sheets. They're, They're really, really good. good. Like really, really good. And we it's just, amazing we that just they work. We packs just this week, didn't we? It's amazing that they work mm. through the <laughs> skin, stamp and cut and emboss machine. <laughs> that is very cute. Now I'm going to try a different. Um, A different sentiment on this one. So this one here I used. <laughs> Someone was... asked if you're an architect. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you tell? Because he needs a proper foundation. <laughs> now this one here that I used on the previous version is from Bragworthy. And that one has... I love Bragworthy. It's, it's cool. cute. Mm. But this one here that I'm going to use is actually from Artfully Layered. Since I used the tropical dyes. That's a good idea. Keep it with the same bundle. So I'll just use this piece of scrap. I love how over the top their, their um, spikes are. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Yeah. It's like, have fun with it. <laughs> What's this one? Good job, Denise. Hey there. I've put up, put up a link for ordering. If you live in Australia, you can shop with us. And just keep in mind that we've got customer cards that you receive. We also have a loyalty program. We collect tokens. Have you been... Um... Yes, I've been stamping. Um, <laughs> <laughs> hey, I was literally just crafting just before I know, you I came. Know, I know. <laughs> I'm getting <laughs> triggered. I shouldn't be baited by the gaslighting. I should just go, we'll clean it then. I have to learn. Um, so, yes, as I was saying before someone interrupted me and judged my unclean block, <laughs> if you want to shop, you will get the homemade card, the loyalty vouchers. What else do they get? If you join A our team. tutorial. If you join our team, you get a free mug and bag this month. Yeah, free mug and bag, pins, lots of cool stuff. We love to spoil our customers and our wow, team members. that is such a nice Beautiful. sentiment. Yeah. So, yes, if you have any questions about shopping with us or becoming a team member, just let us know. I'll put our contact details here. Contact us. Now, I'm going to stamp... Each one of these in the color of the card stop the card base. That's a good idea. Oh, that's right. You also get a um, free card class. So if you're brand new to <laughs> card making, um, you get a card class for free. So we'll give you lots of support too. Did you mean to do it upside down? I didn't. <laughs> but I'm going to cut it out anyway. Yeah. Um, 
Now, how am I going to cut it out? I think I'm just going to cut it out. Wow. I know. Impressive. I slightly didn't do it straight, but that's okay. I think I... <laughs> I like Susan. Whose room is this, Bruno? <laughs> I don't know. Whose room is it? <laughs> Trust me, Susan. He always has a comeback. <laughs> I can never win. I, it's just easy to go, you're right. Yeah, you're 100% right. It's just calming. It's peaceful then, right? <laughs> but Bruno did start getting some real... <laughs> what did you order this week for your room? He's like, nah, I don't want to come in this room anymore. I'm going to get my own stuff. So what did you order for yourself? Everything. Your own trimmer. I already had a trimmer. Yeah. Got my own skin. Your own stamp and cut and emboss machine. Did you get a bigger one? Or the Initially, mini? I started with a mini. Yeah. And then you went and for I the big one. I got my own stamperitis. <laughs> He's becoming independent. He's like, I'm getting my own stuff and I'm going to do it in my own room. And then he got his own... Ta He's got like um, Ikea furniture coming. He's like, I don't need your room anymore. I can set it up the way I want it. So it's just a bit. Oh yeah, I think I, if I do it tuck like it that, underneath. tuck it under. <laughs> I like that. That's very cool, isn't it? I like that a lot. I yeah. like it a lot. Yeah, that's really good. And I'm not even going to dimensional it. <laughs> We've even got our own coffee machine, Susan, in our own rooms. <laughs> it's the best. It solves everything. Brenna didn't like the way I squeezed the to toothpaste, so the solution is. We have our own toothpaste. Easy. Fixed. Can squeeze it how I like. talks about toothpaste, but I've never said anything about toothpaste. Yeah, you used to. But we haven't shared toothpaste for a very long time, so it hasn't been a conversation. But I am bad. I, I don't brush I my teeth. I squeeze it from the middle. I don't even brush my teeth. You do so. Otherwise, I'd be like, you stink. Go away. <laughs> Oh wow. That They're looks cool. really good. <laughs> okay, one more thing, people. <coughs> what is it? <laughs> oh my goodness, we're running out of basic light. There's another seven up the top. We're all good. Card inserts, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? I'm surprised that you haven't said, yeah, because you can't have nudie runs. <laughs> so Megan asked, if we're splitting rooms, who gets the kids? They get to choose. They choose. They choose. And they just go from one and room to the other. And they go from one room to the other. They've got beds in both rooms. Joint custody. <laughs> Remember that strip that I cut off? Oh, that's clever. I know, I'm a clever person. Yeah, you are a clever person. And I'll do them at the same time. That's so true. The sentiment looks like that's exactly what they're doing. They're like jumping up on their back legs and going, Hey there! <laughs> hey there, Georgie girl. <laughs> oh, Jenny's going to buy a dog pram today. A we're, dog pram? We're getting to the point where we need that for Jasper, yeah. don't we? You know, I used to see them and I used to think, why We would judge ya? people. Why are you having a pram? Let the dog walk. But as they get yeah. older, you're like, oh, poor little things. <laughs> Got to squeeze toothpaste Sorry, the everyone. I was doing it off screen. That's all right. We'll forgive you. <laughs> Please forgive, forgive me. me. Too late to apologize. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a broccoli shirt today. Broccolini, yes. Mm, I like your broccoli shirt today. This is trimmy, trim, trim, He's going to be in the corner of his room surrounded by dimmies. <laughs> okay. Everybody, I'm nearly finished. This has been epic. No, nah, it's but not But it feels good. like the card wasn't really that long. But we did the swaps. Yeah, we did right. the swaps, yeah. So Jennifer said a really good point here about her upline. She doesn't hear from her team leader. Mm -hmm. And we have a very good solution for that. 
So basically what you can do is if you... Speak to Stampin' Up! <laughs> no, the best thing to do... Oh, make sure it's the other way around. Yeah. Yes. Um, the key thing with being a Stampin' Up! demonstrator is we're all independent. So I think there's this like weird... Oh, the women independent! <laughs> there's this weird thing that we think that our team leader should support us. And if they're not, then we feel like we're somehow being ripped off. My team leader... And, you know, she's the best. We love we her. We love her. But she lets us just do our thing. Like, you know, she'll check in here and there, but we're independent. You know, we do our own thing and we create our own team and we create our own fun. So even if you don't have a team, you can easily set up like a little Zoom catch up with other demonstrators. You could, what's other things that you could do? Oh, that's so cute. You can watch us. Yeah, you can come on here, watch our YouTube. You can set up your own YouTube and then create your own little community. I just had an idea. Ooh, I love ideas. Um, but then there's also lots and lots of training out there now. Like we've got training, demonstrator training, Lisa Curcio, Rhonda Wade. There's a lot of people that do training. So you're not without support. You've just got to go where you feel you'll get the most support. Yeah. But don't, like, yeah. Do you have a sharpener? Um, somewhere. Where? Who even knows? You're asking a very difficult question. What do you need to sharpen? One of the pencils. Uh -huh. I okay. It, I think it's in here. Instead, this might not work, people. It's all right. Let's try on one of the older ones to see if it's going to work. Oh, the belly. Yes, that's a very good idea. It at least shades it. Okay, yeah, yeah I like that. Good. Let's do it. And what is this called, Bruno? This is the chalk marker. Yeah. Often overlooked. Often overlooked. I think I've overlooked it for a very long time. I need to pull that out again. And so it's not like it's not a solid color, but it has. I really like it. Mm. I have to colour nicely though. So mm. yes, Jennifer, make the most of your situation. Don't look at what you can't control, look at what you can control. That's my advice for you. It's excellent advice. Yeah. For life. Yeah. Because we can focus on things we don't have, but just make it happen. What do you think, people? I love it. That's so stinking cute. It is very cool. I like oh, it. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> How's it going to look on this cover? Yeah, and that's a really good point, Jennifer. She said, I want the support. I just don't want to pay someone for the information. Mm. Um, and, you yeah, know, there is a lot of free videos out there free things free like even communities that you can get together um but sometimes like i notice on our community sometimes you might have to invest in order to get quality people um and then that investment pays off huge dividends in the long run because just the type of people and the type of support that you receive oh um yeah that looks the best i love that that's just made it like ridiculously amazing oh my goodness <laughs> drop the chalk marker drop the chalk marker that looks so good i really like that people <laughs> hey there <laughs> and um kathy's just said i never knew what you could use the chalk marker for well there you it's go. also good like when you're doing nighttime scenes you can mm. just like dot around yeah do um, like s sort of dimmed stars. And let me let me just tell you that this is a lot easier to use mm. than the white paint. In fact... Yes, it's a lot less messy too. I'm going to try something. What are you going to try? I'm going to try something. And I think it's better than the pencil too. I'm going to try something, people. Oh my goodness, are you using another full... Ah, oh, do you reckon it would do something? I don't know. I don't oh. know. Because the chalk, the chalk painter is um, water-based, isn't it? So it's not going to have a hissy fit. Look, it's going to come off. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a bit too light. It's a bit light. 
I think the way you used it is brilliant. Colouring in afterwards. Anyway, forget about that. No, that's the um, way we find out. Test it out. We chopped our chamois. Sham, wow. You got your own chamois too, didn't you? Oops. Did you get your own chamois? I did. I got two. Two? What else did you get? Um... Cardstock, paper, ink. No, so I'll have to come in here for cardstock and the stamp sets. Oh, so we'll get to see you every now. Every and then. now and then, yeah. <laughs> <coughs> That's so nice of you. <laughs> oh, I love it. You're gonna hold it up, hold it up, so you can get your picture. It's still on that. Yeah, that's all right. <coughs> Ta da. <laughs> That's Which way do I do it? That very cute. Way. <laughs> ah, no, that way. <laughs> they are very, very cute, <clears throat> Bruno Batucci. I'm very excited. Um, <laughs> thank you very much for watching. Now, yes. just in summary, Kylie Joe. Yes, Bruno Batucci. Scooch on over. Hi there. Um, reminders. Celebration. You can get this awesome otter stamp set. Echidna porcupine. Echidna porcupine <laughs> for free. Place an order for nine of $90 or more, um, and you can select that as your free item. Um, if you want to join our team, mm -hmm. you get you pay. Let me let's see if I can do this. <laughs> let's get the math. $169. Correct. You select $235 worth of any products. Mm -hmm. Then if you join our team up until March 15th, 16th, 16th mm -hmm. you can select an additional, on top of that, mm -hmm. two free stamp sets. Any stamp sets, except mm -hmm. for celebration stamp sets. Any stamp sets, any value, mm -hmm. choose the most expensive ones. <laughs> um, excellent value. Mm -hmm. And if you join our team, the starter kit is free postage. And mm -hmm. so you're saving... Twelve dollars or something. Yeah, I think like it was that. like eleven fifty or something in postage. So, yes, mm -hmm. celebration is the time to join our team, and we showed you in our video today. I just put the joining link actually. Join our team. I'll put it in capitals because we want you to join. Please. It's good value. You saw in this video some of the things that um, you can join in if you mm -hmm. join our team. Yeah. Um, you can join our team swap. There are so many other things that. Uh, you have access to when you join our team. Um, you will have a quarterly minimum, which works out to be about a hundred and something dollars. A hundred and twenty. I think it's a hundred and twenty dollars a month with the discount. With the discount, but, but if you can't reach if it, if you can't reach it, that's okay. fine. Um, but the come good thing is, customer. you can come and co join us mm. as a customer. The good thing is, is about is. You don't have to spend that money all yourself. Mm. You can have your friends join together and mm. you can um, get them to place orders in your online store. Yeah. So, um, but $120, I can do that with my eyes closed. Yeah. That's all I have to do in a month. Yeah. <laughs> the products are amazing. And the products that we have now are amazing, but then there's new products that mm. come out and you have access to <clears> the <throat> products early and you get to make the. Um, all of those purchases mm. at a discounted rate. Because we've got the brand new annual catalogue. Pre-order starts in April. Yeah. Because the new catalogue comes out in May. Look, we've got access <laughs> to items now yes. um, that you don't have access to. There's some amazing yeah. ocean um, products that you don't have access to, mm. but we do. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> we, just, we, uh, we know that it's the best value uh, for you to join our team. Mm. Um, and I don't think you'll regret it. Uh, no. All of my customers that did join, they the only thing they regret... Is not doing it sooner. Is not doing it sooner. Yeah. So they're like, ugh, why didn't I join up earlier? What was the um the king from Madagascar? What animal was that? The lion. No, you know the one in the jungle? You don't remember the Madagascar? Because that's what someone said he looks like, and he does. I forget what he oh, was. Oh, with like. the... Yeah. What, was it? what animal was he? I don't know. I'm going to have to look him up now. 
Because that is very true. He does look like the little, the king from Madagascar. Madagascar. King. Yeah, maybe yeah, he looks it. like him. So maybe if you changed it to Julian. Julian. Yeah. Ju What's he meant to be? Looks like a... Um, He's a lemur, is he? Mouse lemur. Because you could do his little headdress thing. A monkey, Mazchenko said. Oh, it's a monkey, is he? Ah. So you probably could adapt lemur. it. Lemur. A lemur. Yeah, I think he's a lemur. Yeah. Yeah. Denise, yeah. Yeah. So I reckon if you did, like, you know, green. Yeah, it looks things, like the... Yeah, it looks like the head. <laughs> the headdress. Yeah. yeah, that's true. That would be very fun. Good so, point. Good point. Uh, that's your challenge, yeah, mate. to a Madagascar scene. A Madagascar-inspired... Uh, yeah. <laughs> Do a lima of the two. This cute. one's my favorite. Really? Yeah. Oh, it's so cute. He would look really cute with his little headdress on. Yeah, I reckon it would work. You could do that. Definitely. The stomach looks really good. The stomach looks amazing with the chalk marker. That was a good last-minute decision there, Bruno Batucci. So, so thank you all very much yes. for being here. We've got 99 likes. Come on, let's just do one before we leave <laughs> so we get to 100 for Bruno. If you haven't already done so, <laughs> make sure you sign up for more information about our online stamping retreat yes. with Lisa, Lisa Curcio and Gina, Gina. Curcio Harley. We, filmed, and Kylie we and filmed something this week, like an intro video, and it's so much yeah. fun. We did like these fun rapid fire questions. I know, we we're, we're shh. Kylie I'm just likes to, to tell, tell everything Shh, about everything. Don't tell Lisa, I told you. But honestly, we had so much fun. You're going to get to We're, know us so look, well. We, we are a good team, <clears throat> the four of us. Yeah. And um, mm -hmm. we like each other. We've known each other. We've yeah. worked out we've known each other for, how many years was it? Seven years? Uh, we, I, I remember. Okay, so get this. I didn't mm -hmm. tell you about this. No. When we went to Salt Lake City <gasps> in 2013... Yes. I remember seeing Lisa. Do you? Yeah, because I remember seeing photos of her before. But she wasn't there. She was. Oh, as in at the convention. At the event. yeah. Right. Be the difference. Be the difference. 111, 112, Hunter. <laughs> well, that oh, yeah, we can quick. see it. Thank you. That went up quick. <laughs> so I'll put online stamping retreat. No, what is it? OSR. Yeah, online stamp and retreat. Retreat. So this is the the link to. You're not registering. You're just getting information. More information, and so then registration will start the first of March, and this is also your last opportunity to get our last event. It'll give you an idea. It's a very very different event. Different, yeah. But we do have our last creative day in recording that a lot of people have purchased after the event. There's some fantastic projects from that. Mm. Almost seven hours of content. If you want something in the in-between, because we don't have our Lisa event until the end of March. If you can't wait until the end of March, you want something to inspire you now, then definitely go and get our creative day in. Creative day in... Um, info is there so you can go and get purchase that almost seven hours of content you'll love it two cards each we made using the pansy bundle but there was people that used you Everything can use else. anything like anything you've got just swap it out you don't have to use the pansy bundle um, but you'll love that and I'm you so get to glad. go in the Facebook group too. So you get lots of support. So I think Jennifer kept asking, I don't know where to go for support. I don't know what. Well, that's how you get that support that you need. You know, look for creative opportunities to come to these events. You know, Stampin' Up! have events as demonstrators. So we've got, you know, what's it called? On tour. On, on tour, stage. on stage. So from those events, you can meet other people and you can connect with them and say, let's set up a zoom catch up and craft together and mm. you know there's so many great opportunities it's just asking people you know do you want to hang out mm -hmm. what, what what time suits and um all people can say is look i'm not free or i'm not available and then eventually you'll find someone to hang out with you 
So, yeah. But I think they will. The, these events are really, really great because you will connect with a lot of people. Like all of you connecting here, we will have that with Lisa and Gina as well, which mm. is going to be a lot of fun. Yes, so thank you all for watching. Thank you all for staying for... How long have we been talking? One hour and 40 minutes. Wow. Sorry, everyone, but I'm glad you stayed. Why do you apologise every time? <laughs> You're so cute. I'm glad, I hope you like the projects. I love this one. They're, they're having a ha we're one. hanging out with our friends. Do you, Hey, when you hang out with your friends, you go, Sorry, sorry, <laughs> I don't want to hang out with you anymore. <laughs> yes, so if you're a demonstrator, you can register for On Tour Yeah, now. I've got to do that today, actually. Mm. I wasn't going to say that we haven't done oh, it I'm yet. I'm so naughty. But we will I've do been it. doing the Lisa event. I've been very preoccupied making sure that these projects that we I'm make hungry. for the Lisa event. What are we going to have for lunch? For Kasha. <laughs> and there's also pizza. I made pizza last night. There's leftover pizza with bolognese sauce. So by the time of the Lisa it. event, I'll be twice the size. <laughs> Thank yes. you so much for watching us, everybody. <laughs> we have everybody. to go for a walk as well. Yes. Mm. Look at the light. The light's coming up. No, they didn't hear. Do you like my... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. We're getting much. our blinds fixed so that we don't get this happening. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching, everybody. Thank we'll you. We'll see you later. Bye.